So we're here in this tick seed coreopsis field and you can see here there's a beetle that works on the tick seed coreopsis. You can see the damage here on this leaf at the larval stage. The beetle has been eating this coreopsis here. So the beetle eats plants that are in the genus coreopsis. So this tick seed coreopsis, there's a coreopsis grandiflora they like and, and our plains coreopsis they eat as well. So the benefit of this coreopsis bug is that our birds that are coming in to nest and to raise their first brood, to, to set on their first clutch of eggs, you know, they need to be in good shape to set on that clutch of eggs for 21 days and to just go out for a meal or two uh, while they're setting. And if they don't have enough body fat on them, you know, they just can't successfully uh, lay a clutch of eggs. They can't successfully um, feed that first clutch of babies. So to be in good shape is important and insects are important you know, for, to, to do this. They're, they're very high in fat and they, they need these insects to, to, to be able to put that body fat on. The Coryopsis beetle is um, a really early insect that comes on that can provide energy for the birds. It takes a chain of insects to initiate egg laying and to raise a clutch of babies. So, it could be that the Coryopsis beetle is just one of the first links in that chain. And you know, that's why diversity is important on our farms and in our gardens, you know, for birds. We need a diversity of plants because we need that whole chain of insects, you know, for success for these birds. <laughs>